let's backtrack. About a year ago, the foldable phones were all the rage. You had the Fold, you, we saw these concepts and there's been a lot of excitement around foldable smartphones even till now. But at CES this year, we saw foldable laptops, not just from Lenovo and Dell, but also from Intel itself. Now this is of course a concept device that Intel calls the Horseshoe Bend and is actually pretty interesting. It, it's a 13.3 inch roughly laptop which when unfolded becomes a 17 inch laptop and it, all it is is just one this, one this big screen and um, it's really interesting how Intel has managed to sort of bring that experience of a unified device and a seamless experience into this one device. Of course what in, Intel's prototypes and Intel, Intel's concept devices are only for reference for other manufacturers on in terms of what can be done with Intel's devices, like which is the processors, and they just sort of show the possibility. But when you look at the horseshoe bend, it's pretty cool. So, for example, in one of these uh, demos, you can see the person uh, playing a video on while the device is folded in laptop configuration. And then, when they open the screen out completely, the laptop is the whole screen is filled with the video, and it is definitely extremely immersive. And the potential of you know, a foldable laptop is there. It's pretty, it sounds impressive because once folded, it's what, it's a 13 and a half inch laptop. And when you open it is when it becomes far bigger. But as of now, all of the foldable laptops we have seen are simply concepts, not final prototypes, not in development prototypes, but just concepts. So Intel's Horseshoe Bend is again in line with all of this. It's in line with what you've seen from Dell, from Lenovo, and even in terms of the phones we've seen, the concept is very similar. You've got a foldable display and behind it, they've packed the battery, the compute hardware and all of that. So uh, great work from Intel and we're really looking forward to more of such devices becoming commercially available. But for now, it's nice to see such concepts existing as well. So thank you guys for watching this video and for more interesting stuff from CES, stay tuned to our channel.